Powerball jackpot is once again too large for a lot of us to ignore. It's now up to $550 million and growing larger by the second. A lot of cash causing even more cash to be invested into tickets, but just about everybody will be a loser. KXN's Chris Sadegi joining us live to explain what happens to those tickets that aren't so lucky. Chris? Well, Robert, naturally, you may think that it goes towards paying the tickets that are the winners or to go into making that jackpot even bigger for the next time. Well, that is exactly 63% true. However, some of those losing tickets go to help buy some school supplies. After you take out the 63% paid to winners the, and the money that goes to retailers and the Lottery Commission, it leaves you with about a quarter of every dollar spent on tickets that will go to the Foundation School Fund to benefit public education. Now, the Texas Lottery says over the past 14 years, they produced about $14 billion for Texas education. Now, some prizes are left unclaimed, and that money goes toward other state programs, such as the $8 million given to the Texas Veterans Commission last year. So money for losing tickets is eaten up quickly. Of course, money for winning tickets, nobody really knows what to do with that. I'll buy me a real nice house. I would hope that I'd just play like everything's the same as usual. A farm or go to Japan. Obviously, the first thing I do is go to Disney World. And Robert, at 5 o'clock, I told you that today in Texas, they were spending around $36,000 per minute on lottery tickets. Well, the updated number is just within the last hour. Now, $15 million just today, $46,000 a minute spent here on the Powerball Lottery. We'll send it back to you.